Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Sierra and on my channel, I like to talk everything fashion. In today's video, I decided to try on all of my Helmet Lane tops. You guys really liked my trying on my Rick Owens top video, so I decided to do that same concept video again. Yeah, let's just hop right into it. I got this top actually on hammondlang.com. It was on sale. It was like $50 and I was like, I can't leave it. Like this inexpensive for Helmut Lang, it's a yes for me. And that's pretty much all of my designer stories because I get them all on sale. It is a very basic t-shirt, but if you pay attention really closely to the details around the neck and also at the bottom of the shirt, you'll see that it is somewhat distressed. That is true to Hermit Lane because he is known for his very minimalistic approach as well with a little distressing edge. So that's why I wanted to get this shirt because to me it just speaks Hermit Lane. And it is 100% cotton so I can really wear it all year round. And I really like the fit of it too. It's not hugging my neck but it's a very flattering neck indeed. So yeah this is it and I don't think any of these shirts are going to be available unfortunately you guys because again I get them like on sale. So I can't link them, but you can see how a Helmut Lang top fits for yourself. But yeah, let's get into the next one. All right, you guys, so this is top number two. And I got this Helmut Lang top actually off of The Real Real. And I seen it, again, it was a really, really good price. I think I paid no more than like $40 for it. And I really like it because it's in this like sparkly material. I like to wear this top like layer underneath short sleeve top sometimes or just on its own also it's a really nice top for holiday season so i'm really happy to have a sparkly shirt although typically it's not something that i would go for but again i couldn't pass it up for the price and for sizing you guys for helmet lane tops i would say that they are for sure true to size this is an extra small and it fits me perfectly that black shirt was a small and it you know fit loose but how a shirt should fit and the only thing I don't like about this top you guys is it snags a lot sometimes when I wear like rings and I don't really pay attention to what I'm doing it will snag I think it has a snag somewhere so this is a top that I have to be very careful with so keep that in mind if you are looking to buy something really dainty and or sheer and lightweight like this you just gotta be careful but yes I love it so so much Yes. <laughs> Good, I want you to capture all of my weird moments. All right, you guys, so for this top, I actually purchased it off, purchase it. I actually purchased this top off of Essence.com three years ago now when they had a sale and I got it for like $80 and immediately it caught me because of this beautiful black woman that you see on the front of it. Okay, you could tell that she just didn't know what was going on in this picture and the man was just like, and I just love the aspect of it. And actually it is from, this picture was taken by the Japanese photographer Kaizu Kitajima. This was like an artist series that Hamlin Lane had did with their editor in residence, Isabella Burley. And basically what Isabella did with that series is showcased photographers or artists work and applied it to Hamlin Lane, <laughs> essentially. So yeah, I really like to show you guys and especially because this was taken in New York. I live in New York. Well, I didn't live in New York then, but I like New York then. And it was taken July 4th, 1966. 86. <laughs> it was captured in New York July 4th, 1966. 1986. <laughs> <laughs> it was captured in New York July 4th, 1986. And my birthday is July 6th, so I also thought it was very fitting. And it's one of my favorite shirts, actually. It says Helmet Lang on the back. So I'm not saying too oh, much. Oh. Cute. I love it. I'll have it for a lifetime. I'll let my kids wear it when I have kids. It's one for the books. <laughs> so as you guys can see, I'm not putting this shirt on because I have worn this shirt so much already in my videos. And I'm actually gonna have a video link down below where I'm wearing this shirt. So if you want to see it, you can see it on. This is also from the editor in residence. So Isabella Burley, she hired Shane Oliver to do the spring summer 2018 collection and that's what this is from and it's one of my favorite tops again i will have it in my wardrobe forever and i feel like it's also very true to helmet lane's aesthetic the way i wear it anyway because when i wear this top it is the only pop that you see and if you look through helmet lane's collections he's always known to do a pop of color so this is my pop of color when i wear it all right you guys so that actually sums up all of my helmet lane tops that i own 
And if you guys like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. See you in my next one. Peace.